the other commissioners. Uh, I know we're an island. If you look around, everybody's issued a burn ban except for us. Um, we traditionally, we being the commissioners, traditionally leave that to the nine fire chiefs in the county to make that to make that determination. And um, I spoke with the president of the Whitley County Fire Chiefs Association before the meeting started. Uh, at this time, they really don't they don't really want to ban. They don't. They just don't think we need it. Now, Brianne, that said, okay, and Otto and Katie, okay. That's not to say there are, there still aren't some dangers out there. Um, I believe I believe for the media that the Whitley County Fire Chiefs Association is going to be sending you out advisories, but uh, then they'll talk about you know how to be safe in this in this situation. But we do want to. We'd like to try not to have a ban if we could possibly keep from it. And even if we need, if we need to do something, I think it'll be more along the line of an executive order. Kathy showed us one this morning from Johnson County um, that looks really nicer than a, than a burn ban. So uh, at this time, as we sit here today, Whitley County is not going to issue a burn ban. So. However, Columbia City is still under one. So. I, Columbia City yes. is still under one. That's, that's right. And I don't know what there's. I think everybody yeah. wants to know what effects they're going to have on the Fourth of July fireworks, and the answer is, beats me. I don't know. So. Okay. Thank you, Kathy. Thanks. All right, Paula, Nikki, and your friend Troy Center.